What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about the power level and what you can expect when the Witch Queen DLC and Season 16 start on February the 22nd. Bungie outlined what changes they were making to the power level and what the max power level was going to be. And today I'd like to give you kind of those details. Now there's not a lot of change to exactly how power cap and power level works, but it is going to be a good bit higher than it is right now. Before I get into all the details, be sure to check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course the affiliates here on the channel, Empire Jerky and Amazon Associates. Also be sure to check out the merch store that is linked in the description as well. If you're not subscribed to the channel, I'd appreciate it if you go ahead and hit that sub button. And if you enjoyed the video, I'd appreciate it if you hit that like button as well. It really helps me out a lot. Now, when it comes to what you can expect when you log into the game on February the 22nd and the DLC is out, season 16 has started, the power floor is kind of what they worded as will be 1350. Any player who signs in will be at 1350. So if you're a brand new player or a returning player, all guardians will be at level power level 1350. And it says through general gameplay, players can reach the soft cap of 1500 by doing you know, just your normal things, completing activities, opening chests, pretty much getting rare and legendary drops. You can just kind of put those into your gear and get from 1350 all the way up to 1500. Once you reach that 1500 soft cap, players will need to then earn powerful drops from vendor challenges and other objectives and activities in the game to go up from 1500 to 1550. So pretty much the same concept as we've been used to now. So you go from getting your blue gear and stuff, getting leveled up to that kind of, you know, end point from the floor cap to the soft cap and then from the soft cap up to the next point you're going to need to get that powerful gear once you hit 1550 you're in the final stretch to the hard cap which will be 1560 and you will be able to earn that 1560 through raids trials of osiris iron banner and other in-game pve sources so all that stuff that you know we're doing now if you're getting into getting pinnacle gear you're used to going out and doing your things weekly for your pinnacle pieces now, some of these will change, so keep that in mind. You know, some of this content is getting vaulted. It says make sure that you kind of keep an eye on what pinnacle and powerful sources there are as the yearly, you know, content and seasonal content kind of shifts. Of course, the new expansion content with the Witch Queen will give us, you know, new seasonal things to do. So right now, of course, you know, you can go into the helm and do a lot of things in there for pinnacle gear. Of course, most of that stuff is going to be gone because all of this stuff, of course, you know, is getting vaulted. They're bringing in new content. So pretty much like right now, you will have those same options, but just within the new content of getting those pinnacle and powerful pieces. Now, when it comes to some of the stuff that we still have available that is still in game right now and that will be in game later on, the things like, you know, you're doing your three strikes, you know, your nightfall, you have a certain score, those things will still be available, but a lot of those seasonal things will not be because we're going to have new seasonal activities there. So we'll have new seasonal activities to get powerful and pinnacle gear. So make sure, you know, if you're purchasing that DLC, that Witch Queen DLC, you're getting that 16 season pass or that season 16 pass uh, that you're, you know, paying attention to what all offers powerful and pinnacle gear as you're ranking up, you know, from that floor of 1350 up to are up all the way to that max cap of 1560. I kind of want to make a quick video letting you guys know what that power level is going to be, you know, what we're all going to start at and what, of course, the hard cap is going to be. Leave me a comment with your thoughts. Let me know what you think. I think 1560 sounds great. I'm assuming six, uh, season 16 is probably going to be a pretty long one. I'm assuming several months. It seems like they go, you know, several months in with their content. Of course, it's going to take a while for some players that don't get to play a lot. I know some people may not get to play all the time every day. It's going to take you a while to get to that point. So it's going to be a pretty fun grind if you like grinding out stuff, you know, ranking up your gear, looking for new uh, gear, new content, you know, all the new things we're going to have available to us. So leave me a comment with your thoughts. And of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you hadn't subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.